Hey guys, Marshall one here and welcome to my first video in Battlefield 1. I know I previously did few videos about Battlefield 1, but since uh, full game is released, this is my first time nice <laughs> playing this game. I know I'm still a noob, you know, and I'm trying to get used to this game because also I'm playing this map for the first time and I really like to record uh, my first videos and first moments because somehow I believe later I will get better in this game and that I will be able to compare my previous videos to my new ones and simply that's the something uh, I really like to do anyway today I'm playing with uh, Automatico M1918 which is in my opinion one of the best weapons not only for good players but it's also very very good weapon for beginners simply for people like I am and I already did a review full video uh, about uh, this weapon and so far it got uh, around 15k views and I'm, I'm really happy and thankful to you guys so I hope if you wanna watch my review about this wa uh, this weapon then you could see it at the end of this video because I will leave it as annotation so uh, anyway even if I said what makes this weapon really one of the best weapons for beginner uh, I believe it won't be a problem to repeat it once again and once you learn how to control a fire rate of this weapon and how to get used to its fire rate and vertical recoil I believe uh, you will be able to master this weapon and you will see how very effective it's actually in close combat and in my opinion until you reach a uh, level 10 to unlock that Helfridge weapon you may use this weapon and even later you can use this one uh, because it has more bullets it's killing faster has a higher damage uh, but in my review about this weapon I already Ooh, look at this guy he's camping oh my no <laughs> Uh, in my video I already said this weapon has so many uh, great options but only negative thing is a small magazine uh, you know you have only 25 bullets in each magazine and if you don't know how to control your shooting you will find yourself usually without ammo and you will be spraying your bullets so have in mind that I already said that you wanna make sure to reload this weapon uh, on short reloading where it takes around 1.8 seconds if you find yourself wasting uh, your ammo and going to empty it then you will need around 3 seconds to reload it so always make sure to reload your mag before it's totally empty because you don't wanna probably go into a close combat fight without bullets because it will really take a lot of time to reload it anyway that was something that I really wanted to share with you at the start of this video so I will try more to focus uh, on this game and to hear from where those guys are coming but uh, I know this won't be a the best gameplay ever you probably seen and I hope you guys will not mind me about that because uh, I really wanted to share this video with you and my first gameplay because you know maybe a lot of you will be watching this video and probably you just started playing this game as I did so so I don't know in future I will try maybe to make more videos about Battlefield 1 and do my uh, videos how do I level up and going for the maximum rank and to be honest at the moment I really have no idea what is the maximum rank so if you guys know please let me know down in comment and also if you have some suggestion uh, what should I do in my videos and basically give me advices because you know I'm still new and I, I did switch from Call of Duty to oh nice 
Shovel, shovel, shovel! I did switch from Call of Duty to Battlefield 1 because Call of Duty became so much robotic game and I'm really having fun here and I really like World War 1 game so that's why I'm here and I hope we will have one great time and also that I will gain experience uh, in this game and of course learn the maps because I think it's the most important uh, thing in game to learn maps and learn how to control a weapon and how basically game is working so oh it's equal I thought we are losing for a second okay we are losing now definitely uh, anyway also I will try to reach uh, assault level 10 then I will maybe do a video and guide for you guys of course when I get better because I cannot guide you in something where I'm not good uh, but I will try to show you best assault weapon on level 10 and I believe you already know it's Halfridge gun but I will make sure to make this video and show you how that weapon is uh, working but it also has a few big minuses and I believe uh, developers simply made it like that not to be a perfect weapon because you know you always need to add something oh my god oh my god <laughs> you need to add something bad in order to balance that weapon if it's too much overpowered well probably it will have less bullets and maybe less ammo it will be less effective on distance and so on so they nerfed solo tanks I've seen now you have only four shells so I guess they are still overpowered also uh, other tanks are way too better now than uh, solo tanks so they nerf for solo tanks but other tanks are really really overpowered and I believe in future developers should make one update and fix other things uh, in Battlefield because I just started to play it and I already noticed so many bugs and it's really ridiculous for DICE to have something like this but let's hope in the future and new updates it will be fix it I saw also I really hope uh, they're gonna add as they said a Russian army and maybe to add some snow maps because I really like snow maps I've seen them uh, so far in Battlefield 4 and it was pretty amazing so here I just wonder how it's gonna look in a way of course we lost and I know it wasn't a greatest match ever as I told you at the start but I really hope you enjoyed uh, watching this video and you can check out my review about this weapon anyway thanks for watching I hope you will support my content with like button and subscribe down there to stay in touch with my videos anyway I hope to see you next time enjoy